Well, it's about half an hour to go to showtime. This is the very first Mad Mank Cabaret and then Northerners with Attitude Club Night. And, uh, well, it's already the most Mancunian night in Manchester. That's because we've got a guest list longer than the list of credits on the end of Lord of the Rings. Vinnie Riley of Jerutty Column hasn't turned up. He did the same thing back in 1978. Thought he'd be moved on with that by now. Hope you get well soon, Vinnie. And then our rapper has only just arrived and not done a sound check. He was supposed to be here at four o'clock. It's now about 20 to eight. So everything's happening. But this night, it's all about bringing the old talent from Manchester together with the new. And you won't get bored by sitting through a 45 minute set of a band when you only like three of their songs. This is all about short, sharp and cheeky. It is not a pole-faced cultural evening. There is culture in it, but it's not for those sort of, uh, it's not for the Didsbury crew really, I'm afraid. This is about having a good time. It's Manchester, it's cabaret. I'm off to get my stockings and suspenders on. That's all still to come, but we're going to kick off with a great new band from Manchester. They've got their debut album out on the 22nd of November, being launched at the Deaf Institute. The album's called Wealth. Please put your hands together for From Carbon. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome New Order, Joy Division, the one and only Peter Hook. The thing that's most important in life is experience, uh, as, we, as you, you appreciate that as you get older. And when you've had a lot of experience, people are desperate to know shortcuts. And yet there aren't any shortcuts. You know, I mean, you can, it's like people fly me. I'm doing one in Brazil in February um, on a panel as we were saying, and you know, the question they always ask is, what, what's your advice for young bands today? And it's never changed, and it was the same advice I got, which was never give up, because as soon as you give up, you're fucked. That's it, isn't it? It's dead simple. And when's, when's this new album coming out? Uh, I, I don't know yet. Um, I'm meeting with Alan uh, McGee soon, and we're going to talk about producers and stuff, and... Uh, Take it from there, really. You and, and you know, are, are you because you live in Glasgow? Were you yes or no? I was one hundred percent yes. Yes. Well, no. I mean, I, I admire the yes vote in Scotland, don't yeah, you? What's that fucking wall for? <laughs> <laughs> well, I, 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 I was a bit, you know, I was supporting it on the social media, but there was a part of me thinking, you know, like when somebody wants to sort of leave a party and they're trying to let everyone know they're going, and you don't give a fuck. Uh, that does happen a lot. Uh, look, I've, I've got to get off now. And you're like, well, yeah, but don't take any cans. 
Thank you. Everything was shaking, started to fall. It hit me like a train. It hit me for hours. I traveled through a wire, saw myself on the floor. If this is how it is, I don't want any more. hands together. I love this song the first time I heard it. This is Jordan Lambert. These pressures, they all need to be released. So it's tough leading a normal life. But I guess you've got to plow through some things. We all hit rough patches, gain some scratches. It's the way life goes. Get you like you're blind Didn't see it coming Get you like you're blind Didn't see it coming Coming Don't let the shit Get in the way Of your heartbeat This is what keeps you ticking Keeps you living We've all got places to go And people to see And places to go And you people to greet Don't let it get in the way Get you like you're blind Didn't see it coming Get you like you're blind Didn't see it coming, coming And things get in the way Things you might not want to say Push them aside Zillion. 
Johnny Hamilton, that's your real name. How on earth did you end up in Manchester? Um, I moved here in 1996. It was um, the same year the, the IRA bombed the Arndale. <laughs> Please welcome, he is the new bard of Salford. He comes from Little Halton. Oh, the one and only J.B. Barrington. I went to my mum's, I've got to go and see my mum because my mum's been fucking hero, she's absolutely fantastic. We went there for a, a body and a brew, fucking milk roll. Who buys milk roll now? It's only my mum buys milk roll. And do you know why my mum buys milk roll? Because she can fit fucking pram on it. That's the only reason why she buys milk roll. And you'll laugh at this. I said to her, I said, Mum, have you got a plastic bag? I need a plastic bag from your books. Yeah. Woolworths record department. <laughs> I shit you not, that's the fucking bag she gave me. Woolworths record department. That's going on, eBay. <laughs> She said, what's the thing you're doing tonight? Because she knew I was doing a thing with Terry Christian. I said, well, I'm doing this thing about on the wall. As, and I said, and Peter Rook's on it, you know. And she went, oh, Peter Rook, I love Peter Rook. I've got all these long players. She's 73, my man, bearing in mind. I've got all these long players. Oh, I love this. I've got, I love that. What's that song? When you're in love with a beautiful woman. I said, that's not Peter Rook, that man. She said I was at the bingo with our Kate and she was saying about Terry Christian. She said, is he the one that sung Harvest for the World? I said, yeah, 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 yeah. And Forgotten Town, that was the one. Your mum's your hero. Is your mum your hero? Anyone sitting here say the mum is the best friend? Fucking brilliant. This is a point called things my mum used to say. If you love your mum, you'll get they like this point. Where did you lose it? I don't know, I can't find it. That's why it's lost. Don't be telling your dad how much them trainers cost. And don't be crossing that road if you run up at half past three. And if you fall off that wall and break your legs, don't come running to me. <laughs> You'll be feeling the back of my hand if you keep on mind. I'll come over there and give you the clout. And if you keep on crying, I'll be up them stairs. I'll give you something to really cry about. <laughs> Get out of my sight, you're getting on my nerves. I'm sick, you're hanging around. I don't care who's at the door. You're not going out until your tea's gone down. I've only just washed them jeans. I think you think I'm a laundrette. I've worked all week for that boo, so sit down and get it hit. Don't be turning on the tears. These walls have ears. I've got eyes in the back of me. I'd have to show you one more time. Get out of that bleeding bed. And if you're playing in the street, don't be giving cheek and don't be messing about. And always remember, no matter where you go, what you do, I'll always find out. <laughs> Be careful on that main road, son, be careful what you do. There'll always be another bus. <laughs> but it won't be another you. <laughs> That's for your mum. Cheers. <laughs> Please welcome the one and only Denise Johnson. <laughs> Chances are 